Valorant is known for teasing their upcoming maps, ages, and cosmetics prior to their release. They've done it with Fracture, Breeze, KO, and some others. In this week's video, I'll be showing you every single tease we have for the new Valorant agent, Deadeye, a Sentinel class agent who specializes in gunplay and mechanical outplays. Going in chronological order, the first tease we've ever gotten for Deadeye was actually a player title in the solo contract. While no other agent contract player titles have become agent names, the code name for an agent named Deadeye was found in the game files. The second tease for Deadeye came out in late June titled Watch Year One Anthem on the official Valorant YouTube channel. At 3 minutes and 22 seconds into the video, we see glimpses of the character model of Deadeye as this suave, slicked back assassin character with a huge gun. On the gun in these images is also the word Deadeye if you zoom in and flip the orientation around. The next tease for Deadeye came in the Fracture Map teaser trailer released on the Valorant YouTube channel. The video opens up with the bullet flying through the air and converging with another bullet and the Radeon Collider on Fracture. This has been confirmed to be Deadeye by this spot on the map Fracture. There is also proof that it was another Deadeye because if you're on the opposite side of the map, you can see the exact same thing. These two setups show that it was Deadeye with his big gun, whether it's a sniper rifle or something else. And not only is it rumored for the narrator of this trailer to be Deadeye, but later on in the trailer we hear the narrator say they did it for a quote, noble cause, but sacrifices had to be made, unquote. Hinting at this narrator's connection to these Deadeyes. This is again supported by him saying, quote, such a pity, sarcastically. The narrator even has a French accent, and a later trailer for Episode 3, Act 2 on the Valorant YouTube channel was confirmed by Evan Blaze on YouTube as a French song. But before getting into the next clue, don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy the video and can't wait for Deadeye to be released. Now, a, a little bit ago, Valorant released a State of Agents article chock full of clues and easter eggs. The first being at the beginning, saying time is weird right now. This could be in reference to a possible ability set with Deadeye. We have had also uh, other clues with time that I'll go over a bit later. And at the bottom of this article, it says, quote, Control F, new agent, where it directly says that the next agent will be a Sentinel, focusing more on mechanical outplays with an additional focus on gunplay. It ends off on the French word magnifique, hinting just towards that more of a French character. This basically just means magnificent in English, but under this text we get an image of this gold spoon in a coffee. However, it was pointed out by Twitter user Sinful that the coffee is one with a double shot of espresso, possibly hinting toward a double shooting ability, maybe with his big gun or sniper, um, or even a two bullets on a fracture. There is also a business card under it, and it was also said by Sinful on Twitter that it is a business card from a Kingdom Corp employee. This could work into Deadeye's history with Kingdom Corp or Kingdom Company uh, and why he blew up the Collider. Also, it was pointed out by Twitter user LE6Linder that in the French article there was a mention of the Eiffel Tower. But two days ago, BCT Brazil tweeted out this video. In it, we get glimpses of the agent model of what is presumably Deadeye. I personally really like this character model. It seems really smooth and minimalist. But the final clues I have are physically in Valorant. I have some things from the Episode 3 Act 2 Battle Pass. There are a few cards that stick out to me personally. The Skin Bait card has a trap with a scope pointing to it. This is also included as the Epilogue card. Um, this just, to me, hints towards the possible ability of like this gun skin trap when they pick it up. It like alerts you to a location or it kind of like disperses like a weakness, kind of how like Astra's stun does. Moving on to the next card, we have the two firearm cards in the battle pass, hinting towards possible, uh, possibly the two dead eyes having separate affiliations with those. Um, I think that'd be a cool thing, how they're kind of like against each other, but the ammo they use is kind of like the same still. Um, or maybe they just own those two companies. Now, the Times of Bunny is in the same colors as the shown images of dead eye and the hint from State of Agents. And this also goes back to that time reference in that State of Agents article with the quote, time is strange. The same color design also shows up again in the Manifest Elegance cart. Again, with this suave, minimalist assassin feel, kind of like a James Bond type with his watch. 
that's all of the teasers clues and hints i was able to find let me know in the comment section down below if i missed any or if any of these shocked you did you guys overlook these did you guys know exactly what they were when you saw them let me know all of that in the comment section down below and i'll catch you in the next video peace out and i wish you all the best